Like, I feel ridiculous doing it, but at the same time, if it's any faster, that would actually be something to consider. This music is also pretty tame, I like it. Let's see if we can destroy these robots. Got our hockey stick. Nothing. Can I destroy it? Well... I don't understand. This thing doesn't really work very. Like this, the, the robots don't seem to be very. Apparently, it's eyes in the back of its head. Okay, I broke it, and look at all that garbage. Ew. I wonder how they powered it. I just remember I always wanted to be able to like walk on the beach after the game was over, but they never actually allow you to do that, which is it feels like a kind of hollow victory, if you ask me. But, oh well. I guess we're going to go to the pier in a little bit, but... Before I do that, actually, I want to go ahead and... Do some other exploring while we're actually... Uh, while we're still here, anyway. I guess a little warning I should give you guys in case... Is that you actually can take fall damage if you jump off. So, be careful with that. You don't take that much because it wasn't that good of a fall, and you don't move any slower. Despite, you know, just being a kid and you landed your feet on some pavement, but it's something to be considering, so be careful. I'm like, yeah, one thing I really remember I like, I love to do was just exploring, well not really not so much exploring, but just skating around. And I think it's because of that that I actually managed to get so familiar with the controls that way. So, you know, I recommend that. Just, if you really feel like you don't have a very good grasp on the controls, Spend some time on this half pipe, you know, let yourself get acquainted with the game and you'll be more familiar with how to play it efficiently. You gotta practice to make perfect, right? So I'm just gonna do that for a while. You know what, whatever, let's just go to the next area. I'm fooling around too much and I, I really have to stop doing that. You'll need 15 silver coins to play the shooting gallery. Look behind the booths and other nooks and crannies. And that's Mackenzie. On the screen without a hand. Yeah, I really... The only characters I remembered were like Raymundo, Tito, the four Rocket Power Gang. That was it. I don't remember very many of these other characters at all. As sad as that may be. But when you haven't watched the show in so long, it kind of just comes without saying. Uh, I, I'm getting old. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I am getting so old. What happened? I haven't got enough coins to enter. I better go back and look around for some more. Why are you talking to yourself like that? And I didn't even know that was there, so shoot. Excellent. Well Excellent. Got enough now. Look look, look at this animation. What animation? That's my point. Whatever, let's go. Step right up. Test your skills at the shooting gallery. Win a prize. Have some fun. Let us have a shot. Okay, the moving target on the roof is worth more points each time you hit it. Use the zoom function with the aim at far targets. So, shooting gallery. You just score points. And they get at least 500. Score 750 to get one extra gold coin. Okay. 
and inverted control, so that's something else to be aware of. So if I play Star Fox Assault, which I did, that should be too much of a problem. Except it's a shooting gallery, and I have inverted control, so that's a problem. That's a very big problem, in fact. This is actually really awkward. Why are the controls inverted for this? Oh my gosh, I cannot shoot very well at all. I keep going up, but I mean to go down. At least it's a reticle, so it makes it easier to aim. Ideally, I think you want to get, at least get 1,000 points, because there's something else you can actually collect if you do that. And, um, this is bad. Crap. I'm really bad at this game, holy crap. You only have to get 500, and I think you can always just retry these at other points later in the game, too. So you should just focus on doing your best. But, okay. But seriously, just do your best, because you'll likely do just fine if that's the case. Because... I'm trying my best, and I am somehow still on par to get the goal, even if I'm not really good at it. Alright, yep. I'm not going to get that extra gold coin, unfortunately. Maybe I was over my head seeing I would 100% this game. <laughs> oh, man. I am... This will be fun, I'm sure. Dang it, I got 685. Well, that's enough for the, adult, for the, for the teddy bear, but I decided not to get the golden coin. I want to retry that. Um, <laughs> yeah, that was... I was... I'm not happy with that. I got exactly 1,000 points. Wow. Definitely better than my first attempt, that's for sure. Alright, I'm happy with that much, at least. Okay, now we have that teddy bear. Let's give it to Mackenzie and we'll finally be ready to go to the lake. I think that's what they call it, just the lake. I don't really remember what else they call it at that point. Not bad, not bad. Okay. So now we have that teddy bear, we can actually get further. Let me change my character on the, um, the Swister because I may not be using it much more otherwise. About time, I saw some action. About time huh? He was waiting for this. This is what he was. This is what he spent his entire life waiting for. Twister's always just been in, in auto shadow, I assume. Yeah, I'll probably be adding out a lot of these loading screens because nothing happens in them. They're just text, which is fine if you're playing this alone, sure, I guess. But at the same time, it's like this gets really repetitive if you are just a viewer and. Far be from me to want to bore people, so I will gladly edit it out if it means that it's just a slightly bit less boring for you. Let me try skate the skateboard again. I can already conclude though, I'm not nearly good enough at this thing to actually, you know, use it. So, I'll go ahead and just play it, do it normally. I don't intend for you to do it. Oh, but you can grind there. Okay, that makes perfect sense. I don't understand this game. I really don't. Took you long enough. Still, better than nothing, I suppose. Just give her the dino and get out of here before she flares up again. Express dino delivery for a Miss McKenzie. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Yikes key okay. So now we have that bus pass. And 
And I think that's actually gonna do it for this session, honestly, because we got a pretty decent chunk of stuff. Yeah, a decent chunk of stuff done already, so... Eh... Next time on Rocket Power Beach Bandits, we are gonna go to the lakes and see what's up there. See you guys next time. In the meantime, I'm gonna get myself reacquainted with the skateboard. Like that, look at that. That looks so weird. To find a lot of physics. 